Okay, this is a super fun way how to set the pivot point of objects. I'm using Playmaker, but this is a general tutorial on Unity as well. So let's go ahead and uh, create a, a new blank cube to make for what, like a door example. And I'm going to go over to Inspector, right click, and do Reset. So it sets it to the world origin. And uh, it's really important to remember the keys. W is position. E is rotate and R is scale. Um, it's important. It's it's really it'll make things really quick and handy. It's not important. Nothing's that important. Okay, so let's go ahead and thin this door out. Okay, that's kind of our door. Hitting W again. Let's get it just above the surface of the ground. Okay, I'm gonna make a blank object here. Empty. Create an empty object. And to make sure we're all lined up, I'm going to go ahead and right click transform over here and reset that as well. And there we are. So, basically, if you rotate any object around, it's around its, its center. That's kind of normal, but it's kind of annoying. So, the quick way to do it is to go ahead and select our game object. Just for kicks, I'm going to go ahead and rename that pivot or door hinge. And I'm going to rename our cube, door. And we're going to put the door inside of the door hinge. Now, just like it, it looks like, the door is a child of the door hinge. Now all you have to do now is just grab the door. And if you look at the center line of both the game object and the mesh, door mesh, we move it to where the hinge should be. Now we're, meant, we're moving the door. And there you go. That's all there is to it. Now if you want to rotate it, you can just grab the door, and now it should behave just like a hinge. And that's it. And just for fun, we're going to make a couple copies of this guy. Control C, Control V. Move him over. And I'm going to do Control V again. Move this guy over. And then Control V again. Him in the middle, control V, control V, and just for fun, we're going to go ahead and change its rotation randomly. Make sure you grab the, the hinge object. It's very easy to uh, grab the child. My mistake. See, it defaults to the child. I'm going to rotate him. And now we are going to take a peek at this, and it'll be this hellish maze for this guy. Whoa. <laughs> okay. I think you get the idea. <laughs> But it's getting caught up in all these these doors. But that's pretty much it. It's easy as that. Okay? Hope this helps. Bye.